1969, my mother, Deborah, was born in Verona, Italy, to Enrico and Paola Bizzazza. She grew up in Vicenza, Italy, a small town just a little bit outside of Venice. She had two brothers, Federico and Niccolo, who she grew up with in a fairly well-off house with a family supported by my grandfather, Enrico's, model train company. She ended up attending a private all-girls Catholic school as she grew up in Italy. Her immigration story started when she went off to college in the University of Verona. After deciding to do an exchange program to Lyon in France, she met my father, Anthony Allen. He was also on an exchange program from the University of Georgia. He was born to my grandparents, Michael and Sandy Allen in Denver, Colorado. They ended up dating for a few years and were able to keep in touch after leaving Lyon by letters and phone calls to each other. My father at one point when working for the Peace Corps in Bulgaria ended up hitchhiking to Italy from there in order to see my mom. After a while, they decided to try and move in together. They debated for a long time whether or not to live in Italy or the United States, but at first they ended up moving to Verona, Italy and living with my mom's parents. However, my grandparents, Enrico and Paola, were not very pleased with the idea of a young, hippie, kind of rough-looking American college student marrying their daughter and living with them. Moreover, to make things worse, my dad couldn't really find work in Italy and getting a visa there was really hard. Because of this, they decided to try their luck elsewhere and move to Anchorage, Alaska, where my dad's parents lived. This was a big change from Italy, not only in weather, but also in terms of culture. In order to expedite the immigration process, my mother ended up getting married to my dad so she could get a green card and work. Four months after the wedding, they, my mom ended up finding work at Nordstrom's. While working though, they decided it was a bit too cold in Alaska for them. Because of that, they decided to move to Portland, Oregon. Here, my mother ended up getting her full citizenship. In 2000, I was born. And in 2002, my sister Angela Allen was also born. At first, we had a really close tie to our Italian heritage, and we were able to visit every single year and celebrate a lot of Italian holidays. However, the more time we spent in America and going to schools in the United States, we seemed to kind of not practice our Italian heritage necessarily as much. Whereas me and my sister were both fluent growing up, we eventually lost the language. And although we still visit today and talk to our grandparents, it's harder for us to connect with them because we have a big language barrier. However, we both hope to resolve this in college by studying Italian there and finding new ways to communicate with our family. And just like my parents, I also hope to meet new people by doing a study abroad.